Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Arcane Gothica Thor. In previous episode, we were um, told to go find some uh, Laika, I believe her name is, from the Dark Horse, and we're just supposed to do some tasks for her now to be awakening our power or magic in us. So we have to do some tasks and get rid of some vermin. So uh, let's get started on that. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay guys, so something kind of sad happened, um, my computer overheated, so I, you guys, the video for killing all the other, uh, bugs, or vermin I should say, is gone, and it's kind of, it, it makes me sad though, now I, I, I had to, I, would, I will be able to record this, uh, footage for the theme part. Uh. Oh god. Ah. I mean it's not that hard to kill her though. It's it's actually pretty easy. Oh god. Man, have your sword out. No, come on, someone's dead. Oh, right here, there you go. Whoa. She took a step right back there. Oh, What's going on? <laughs> My ugly face. Boats. Oh no! Oh, oh my god, what's up? Come with me, my friend. I will take you to Argan. Are What do you intend to do now? Avenge myself upon Robar the Third and his cursed paladins. You wouldn't know a sword from a toothpick. They'd mince you. You want Ivy's death to go unavenged? And what about that of my mother and my friends? No, but what if there was a way to avenge yourself without storming right into your death? Okay, tell me. Hmm. Let's hear it. It is said that there is an ancient temple somewhere in the mountains. They say there is a blessed anvil there. Robar's paladins search for the temple because they want to use the anvil to forge weapons for their campaign against Argan. I see. And I should interfere with their plans. Exactly. Yeah. And if the anvil really does exist, Forge yourself something to speed your vengeance. Where should I start looking for the temple? On the hill back there, in the Cleaved Maiden Tavern. You'll find a mage by the name of Duranis there. He knows a lot of the old stories. Talk to him. Maybe he'll have heard of the temple. How do you know about the Paladin's plans? How do you know about the Paladin's plans? When I was still at Robar's court, I always kept a watchful eye on Lord Hagen and his men. And many a maid servant of the Paladins kept an ear open for me. So who is this Lord Hagen? He commands the Paladins and is a member of Robar's High Council. I doubt he will join me. Will you join me? No. You need to learn to stand on your own two feet. I'll be sailing on to Stuart. When you arrive in Stuart, 
talk to the landlord at the Cliff Tavern. He'll know where to find me. I actually like I really like Diego. Hopefully nothing bad happens to him. Okay, so I have leveled up, so let's look at our skills. We have three to spend as usual, so let's use them wisely. Um, oh, there's more things. Uh, what's this? Sneak makes enemies aware of you later than usual. Uh, the car is level four. Uh, this spell basically burns, throws a burning arrow for Hmm. Should we just get started on like the spell stuff? I don't know. Why not? Okay. Uh, is it always arrows? Why not? Okay, let's do that. We'll, we'll just try to get through everything so far. Ooh. Yes. Oh. Okay. Now we have some spells going on right now. Okay, so up here is the tavern. There's the tavern, I say. Hopefully this ring doesn't make my computer lag completely. But anyway, so let's see. Oh god. I'm not learned how to sneak yet. I'd like to catch up and get into this tavern before these fuckers over here come after me. No, I think they, they, they backed off. Okay, cool. What's in here? Hey, it looks like my blacksmith buddy. Hey, I don't know you. How'd you get in here? By boat, from Fesher. And you expect me to believe that? Look at the beach down there. That's my boat. Hm. I'll let you through. But if you cause any trouble, you'll have us woodcutters to deal with. Got it? Cool then. I'm looking for Duranus. Where can I find him? In the pub or in his room. Your best ass murderer. She'll know where he's at. Okay then, murder. Murderer. The landlady here. Okay. Just go in, you'll see her. Okay. Let's just take a quick look around first before anything. So here's an oxen. I don't want to kill it though. Hmm. Can I use Andrew? What does it do? Really? Okay. Let's get off this thing. So this is like a little area. Ooh! Chest, chest, chest. Ooh. Take all that. I want to sell some stuff though. Cause you know I have I think like a million go goblin um what you calls it and I need to get rid of them because they're uh I can get I get I can get a little a, a pretty penny for it. Yeah, there yeah there she is. Aha, a new guy. Who let you in here? One of the woodcutters from the farm. Just so you know, normally I decide who comes in. I know. I'll have to deal with the woodcutters. Right. Don't you forget that. She actually doesn't look that bad compared to everyone else. Um. I'm looking for Duranus. Duranus. Our noble man? Really think he'd receive a bloke like you, would he? We'll see. Just tell me where I can find him. Oh my God, her hair like, went through room, the fire. Noble man is reading what he always does. I even got to bring his food up to him. I have go up the stairs and out onto the balcony, then turn right. That's where his room is. 
I'd like to have a look at your wares. Can I sell stuff for her? Yes! Okay, so let's sell everything we don't use. This cannot be sold! Really? Okay. Hmm. Okay then, so look at what she has. She has a brass ring. Nah. Meal weapons? No. Uh. For meat? Do. Hmm. We might need some of these things, so I'll buy one of those. And I think, uh, I don't have a lot of money, so I think I'll, I'll be it for now. Okay then. So let's go find this Daenerys person. Oh god, no. Put that away. What are you doing? Okay, so let's see. Ooh, can I sell these scrolls? Okay, so I can craft something. Something right here. Oop. Okay, um... I didn't read what it said about crafting. It should be... I have the thing here. Crafting is... I believe it should be C. Of course it will be C. C for crafting. Okay, so... Alchemy and food. So I can make Amila's best, which I don't really know exactly what it does. It keeps you fresh and healthy and helps against cuts, bruises, rashes. So it should give me uh, some health. So let's do that. Go on, and then I believe I can craft uh, some grilled meat. So let's craft that. I think grilled meat would be so much better. Okay. So okay. So now we know how crafting works. So we can always press C, uh, and then we can craft stuff. So how do we go upstairs? Okay. around is there anything I can take so I can you know eat and keep so never not look around you always gotta search look around you know you never know when you're going to meet so where would the stairs be? oh sod you back here who can I use this to make my stews and stuff like that I guess not <laughs> oh, sorry So where would the stairs be? Stairs, stairs, stairs. Oh, back into the rain. Hmm. So she says she's upstairs. Um, go upstairs to on the balcony, something like that, or another. And he should uh, be somewhere to the right, something like that. I wasn't really paying attention to what she was saying, to tell you the truth. Um. So what's up? Not much. Okay, so aha, there they are. Well, I can't believe I can see that shit right here. Okay, and then I can go upstairs more. Okay, much better. Would it be here? No. Can I take any of the stuff in here? Ever lay my hands on him? What? And to the right. Okay, I got it now. Open the door. There we are. Nope. Picked the wrong one again. Yes, I did. No, don't lock me in here. Let me out. Is it this one? Ah, someone. Uh. 
Hello, sir. Are you Duranis? Yes. What oh, do God. you want? I'm searching for an ancient temple up in the mountains. He is here now. Yes, he I heard here. about a temple up there. Where exactly? Don't know, but there is an archive of old maps in the fortress at Silver Lake. If ever there was a place to find a clue, it's there. So how do I get to Silver Lake? Well, not at all, at the moment. Brigands have occupied the bridge to Stuwick. But the people here are trying to think of a way to deal with the brigands. Help them. Perhaps they'll help you. Okay, then. Who's working on the brigand problem here? Murdra, the landlady here, I'm sure. And I think Rorta has a plan, too. Rorta? A guild fighter. He was here just a moment ago. Where's making vague right. insinuations about secret negotiations with some of the brigands. Decide where to leave your hair Where's or Rorta not? now? He's headed for the old Cedariffian watchtower. To the south of here, on the beach. Okay, what are you doing here? I thought mages hang around the monastery all day long, right? What are you doing here? I thought mages hang around the monastery all day long. <laughs> Some do, indeed. I, however, am on my way by order of Grandmaster Milton. He has expressed great interest in the ancient stone circles scattered throughout our game. And you discovered anything about these stone circles? Have you discovered anything about these stone and circles? Have you discovered anything about the stone circles? So far, only that they drive me insane. <laughs> the Grand Master discovered a way to awaken their power. But all the circles I've found so far are immune to my magic. Hmm, I have a feeling someone's beaten us to the punch. Hmm. How much wanna bet if I do it? What happens when a stone circle awakens? Apparently, the circles are connected. Oh, uh, is that me if fast? If one travel? could establish a connection to one of the circles, the so it should ugly. be possible to travel instantly to it from another circle. We experimented with two circles in Thorniara. Thorniara. But nothing's working here. Well, if you're curious, there's one not far from the cleaved maiden. Okay, then. I got an... Ooh, is that a chest I can take stuff from? Yes. Take as much as you can. I have a feeling we're going to need... Oh, stop raining? Get out of my way. Anything in here? Arrgh. I think that was a cow. Ooh! Almost didn't see this there. <gasps> yes! Okay, so let's get crafting first. Uh, okay, uh, alchemy and food, of course, we can make one of those. Craft, craft, craft. Okay, and I can't make any equipment. So, was it. So this does 12 range power and this does 13 so we shall change that up plus two magic power cool okay cool then so we have a light bow and we have more arrows so let's equip this because i believe you can't really uh shoot arrows with this Now we have a um, crossbow, and with this crossbow, we can actually, you know, do whatever as much. We could do a bit more damage, not insane amount of damage, but yeah, not insane amount of damage, but damage nonetheless. So let's go back downstairs and see what we else we have. To do. So what else do we have to do? Um. Daenerys told you that a band of bandits has occupied the bridge, so let's highlight this one. And... And they burned down Fisher, too. Yep. They burned down my island. Fucking home. Since the war, that's common practice. 
Did you go see our noble man then? Yes, I did. Yes. He suggested that I should lend a hand to the people around here. How are things with you? Anything I can do for you? Mm, why not? Again. You look like a big, strong lad, you do. What do you want me to do? I'm starting to run out of mead, and it'll be a while till the next supply comes. Okay. Oh, I see. You want me to get some for you? From Garve, one of the woodcutters. He must have a few barrels left. Would you get me two? Sure, why not? I'll go to Garve. I'll go to Garve and get you the mead. mead. And then I'll talk to her. Ah, um, the guests will be pleased about that. And so will I. Where can I find Garve? Yeah, where can I find him? Out through the gate, then down the path to the right. Past down the old the watchtower. The right. Past old watchtower. That's where his hut is. Uh-oh. Okay. So, okay. I'm going to leave it for here for now, guys, because I don't want this episode to be too long, because usually Not when you start talking to people, one. you know, things, you know, happen and all that stuff. So, uh, until next time, you guys, peace out. Thank <laughs> you.